YouTube and welcome back to a new video. So, for today's video, we'll be doing a review on Heyday River Scott from the 2019 Docks Racing Day series. This was recently released in Case J, with and the other new cars in Case J are Mo Revlin, Mo De Turner, Duke Colters, which is right here, and Heyday River Scott, even though it's you know, the other ones. So, okay, so all new cars in ah. In. All the new cars in case J are uh, Heyday River Scott, what's his name? Duke Holders, Mo De Turner, Mo Revlin, Gen Tan Sedan, Jenny Toland. Sterling with headset and metallic Shannon spokes. And those are the and so far I've reviewed Duke Coulter's so in all this is in order of what I've reviewed. So far I have reviewed Duke Coulter uh, Mo Rafflin, Duke Coulter's and Mo Turner. But anyways. So let's take a look at Hey David Scott's got the packaging. So we've got a determined yet happy expression on here. We've got the blurred as a background, cars logo. 51 in the circle for Doc's Racing Day. So we've got Hey David Scott, 3 Plus Mattel. On, on the and then we've got the bike after the blister here. And we've got the ridge. We've got the ridge here because it's, it's, it's a main in Thailand die cast. But let's, let's take a look at the back. So I've got the look, 51 again. We've got the car logo. We've got a very nice photo of the Hudson passing Gene Moon when you can just see Louise Nash in the background if you look hard enough. Behind Doc Hudson. The, the description reads Back in the day, Doc Hudson and friends mastered the racetrack with their quick wits and old school ties. And then and then he's got some random translations for it all. And the back of it shows Heyday River Scott, Duke Coulters, Leroy Hemming, and Heyday and Heyday Smoky. And so f and the other two car the other two cars available in the series at the moment are Dirt Track Fabulous Hudson Hornet. And Jet Robinson, and they're both uh, and they're available as singles and in, and in a two pack. Let's take a look at the actual. Oh, and then we've got some legal jack and barcode control logo, all the all the stuff that nobody cares about, but it still has to be put on for legal reasons or whatever. But anyway, anyways, let's take a look at the diecast. So. He's he's like pretty much completely blue, mainly, mainly blue. Much different to the original River Scott, which was like a grey rust sort of colour. And we've got a, a um, we've got a black outline around the windshield. We've got the and then he just his eyes are like a normal expression, looking in the middle, unlike River unlike the normal River Scott size, which are kind of looking to the right. Headlights are painted over. He's got this little grey paint. He's got this little grey thing. Paint spot. Paint spot. It's this grey thing which is actually on the packaging, so it's movie accurate. Same with this. This here. You can see it if you look hard. If you look hard enough, you can see it. And weirdly enough, these aren't on the normal River Scott. I don't. I don't know why. Black tiles with red rims with a white outline, which is the same as regular River Scott. 34 with the grey, which is the grey. Oh, this is grey, so the grey isn't really that seeable here. Only a little line you can see. Um, it's 
blue with a little box in the back one and the two little windows, dual windows, I have no idea. And, but, and then on here it's aged a lot more, it's all rusted. MCNC Me is the license plate. Yeah, MCNC Me, and I can't tell what it says above, it's way too small. And it also says MCNC Me on here. Let's see if I can read the other bit of license plate on here. I think it says North something. Yeah, North something, I have no idea. And this side's pretty much the same as this side, and then on the front, their smiles are pretty much the same. The grill is basically, basically the same, although it's a bit more shiny on River Scott. On Hayday River Scott, I mean, sorry. And you can see through the bill and their engine, see if you look here. And the hood in the engine that you can see through. So you can see where it's got like, normal Scott's eyes if you look closely enough, because you can see through here. And, then, and, then, and it's the same on regular River Scott. See? Let's compare him to Duke Coltis, who's very similar. There's a very similar model apart from the see through engine bit mainly. So, and, and the bumper on the front, and some other random stuff so although they look to be very similar models they aren't although they although they look to be the same model they aren't actually they look like the same model but they're actually but if you take a really close look they're actually quite different although they're still a little bit similar I guess anyway, anyway so that's it for the video so thank you all very much for watching so please leave a like subscribe comment favorite share so let me know what car from case jar should review next so we have, so I did this at the start of the video, but I'll go over it again just to remind you all. So, so far we have left to review from KT. Gen Tan Sedan. Jenny Toland. Sterling with headset. And metallic Shannon spokes. And I actually did a um, straw poll about an hour or two ago. And... Jenny Toland and Hayday River Scott tied, but I decided to do Hayday River Scott. So the Jenny Toland review will actually be coming tomorrow. And then after that, there's Gen it's between Gen Tan Sedan, Sterling of Headset, and Metallic Shannon Spokes. I'd personally do Gen, then Sterling, then Shannon, but it's all up to you. It's all up to what you guys want to see first and what you guys want to see second and last. And then there's also Carl Clutch from the case, even though he's a new, I thought I'd throw him in, because why not? And Metallic Dino Drafts getting creased off, which I got in the mail from, which I've gotten in the mail from eBay recently, so I've thrown them in as options as well, because they're exclusive to that Europe case. Um, yeah, so to finish with the video, let's bring in the Docks Racing Day squad. we got Dirt Track Fabulous Hudson Hornet. Jet Robinson, Heyday Smokey, Jet back here, Leroy here, and Jude here. So there's yeah, that's it for the video. So thank you all very much for watching. Please remember to like, subscribe, comment, favorite, share. Let me know down below what car from KSJ I should review next over what I went over, plus Metallic Dino Drafts getting crease off. And I'll see you all in the next video, which will, which will be the Jenny Toland Diecast review.